Finding your drive in life is important. Regardless of whether you are looking to lose a few pounds, build an online business, or land your dream job, you need to have the drive to attain what you want in life. You see, without a clear driving force, you can feel unanchored, disoriented, lost, and even stuck in life. Knowing what drives you forward in life will help you better perform, become more productive, and achieve meaningful goals in your life. But how do you do that? How do you find your drive in life? That's exactly what I'm about to share with you in this video. I'm going to share with you five little tips how you can find your drive in life so that you can make more progress, strive forward, and achieve greater success. Hey there, this is Sean from stunningmotivation.com. If you're new to this channel, subscribe right now so that you will discover more videos on how to achieve personal success in life. So, are you ready to find your drive in life? Let's get started. First, you want to understand what success means to you. Understanding what you want out of life is one of the most liberating discoveries in life. Success can mean many things to different people. Some people want to build a multi-million dollar business. Some people prefer to live by the countryside and live with nature. Some people want to change the world and end poverty. And some prefer to become a professional athlete because that's what they love doing. What about you? You have to ask yourself, what do I want out of my life? What kind of life do I want to live? What does success look like to me? The better you understand what you want in life, the better connected you will become with your inner self. Many people are living in a crossroads. They have no idea what they want, and they are living a life that is not what they truly wanted. They are influenced by their peers, their parents, their teachers, their friends, and the society at large. Think about people who dread going to the office. You see, you are going to spend half of your life working, and if you are not doing something that you love, that means you spend half your life doing things you hate. Don't you think that's ridiculous? So, find out what success truly means to you. Find out what kind of life you want to live, and that's the first step in finding your drive. Always remember this saying from Seth Godin. Instead of wondering when your next vacation is, maybe you should set up a life that you don't need to escape from. The second tip that will help you find your drive in life is to know your why. Understand your purpose for, for doing things. Why do you do what you do? If you have a goal to pursue, ask yourself why you set the goal in the first place. There is a saying, when there is a will, there will be a way and how strong your will depends on how clear you are with your why. Think about smokers who try to get rid of their smoking habit but fail, until one day they were diagnosed with lung cancer and if they continue to smoke, they will die. From that moment on, they stop smoking. So what changed? Their why. Their purpose for doing it. When your purpose for doing something is strong, empowering and emotional, you will become unstoppable. Just like people who want to get back in shape or people who want to build a successful business. The journey is difficult, but it is not impossible. Only those who have a clear understanding of their why will have the unbending will to do it, even when things are tough. Therefore, if you want to find your drive in life, first, discover your why. I suggest you read this book from Simon Sinek. Start with why. It is one of the best selling books you should read. The third tip in finding your drive is to identify your inner values. We are all wired differently with different inner values. This is why some people prefer an adventurous trip like hiking the Himalayas while others prefer to spend their days in the museum. Your values are what's important to you in life. Think about the different subjects in school. Some students love physics and some love music. And this is what differentiates us as human beings because we have different values. We view things differently in life and we will have different priorities. Think about a movie you love to watch. Do you like to watch action movie, love story, or horror movie? To make things simple, knowing your core values help you behave and make decisions that match who you want to be in life. When you know what matters to you, 
it helps you choose the right career and progress in the right direction in life. It makes you feel safe and secure. It makes you feel you are being yourself. You may want to consider your experiences in life. What are the best and painful moments in your life? For example, if you have won an award for teaching, perhaps it is possible that motivating others and leaderships are important values for you. The fourth tip that will help you find your drive in life is to grow your passion. Listen carefully, I'm not saying find your passion. Instead, I'm saying develop your passion. This means passion is like a skill. You can grow it. Have you ever listened to a song that you don't like at first, but after listening to it a few more times, you started to like it? That's how passion can grow. The more you dig deeper into a subject, the more passionate you will become. Think about bumblebees. Do you think you are passionate with bumblebees? I don't think so, right? But if you study and learn more about bumblebees, find out what good they do, how they reproduce and relate to each other, where they live, how they get food, etc., you will eventually find the enthusiasm you need for bumblebees. That's how passion and enthusiasm work. The more you learn and improve on a subject, the more you will grow your passion for it. Just like tennis. I know nothing about tennis, and so I'm not passionate with tennis at all. But for badminton, it's a totally different story. I play the sport every week. I know who are the top players. I watch badminton games in most major competitions. And that is how I grow my passion for the sport. Remember, the more you dig deeper into a subject, the more passionate you will become. And your passion is one of the most powerful drives that will inspire you to pursue the success you desire in life. And finally, the fifth tip on finding your drive in life is through trial and error. That means trying things out. How do you know where your passion or motivation is? Well, you try. If you hate your job and you have the thought of quitting your job to start a business selling pizzas, you don't have to jump directly into the business. Instead, take a part-time job in a pizza restaurant or volunteer to work for free in the pizza restaurant over the weekend, right? This way, you will discover if you truly love to build a pizza business. Just like how do you know if you love to eat sushi? The easiest and fastest way is to try it. When you want to find your drive in life, adopt the shotgun method. Meaning, you scatter your effort and try as many things as possible. And once you have discovered your drive, zoom in and focus. That's how you do it. So, these are the 5 tips on how to find your drive in life. Number 1. Understand what success truly means to you. Number 2. Know your why and find out your purpose behind why you do what you do. Number 3. Identify your core values. Number 4. Grow your passion by digging deeper into a subject. And number 5. Trial and error. Try as many things as possible before you commit to anything. Before you go, I just want to let you know that you can download my free guidebook called the 9091 rule. You can use this rule to help you achieve any goals you want in just 90 days. You will learn how to increase your focus, performance, and achieve real results in just 90 days. Just go to freesuccessguide.com and you can get the guidebook for free. If you like this video, smash the like button right now. More importantly, Subscribe to this channel so that you will receive updates and more videos on achieving personal success. That's all for now. Thank you for watching. See ya.